Trying their hand at tarmac racing and grid in an open world and fuel, Codemasters is ready to get dirty once again in Dirt 2, the latest installment in the Colin McRae Rally franchise. Like its predecessors, Dirt 2 focuses on off-road races and World Rally Championship events. Unlike the first in the series, Dirt 2 will be heading to the Nintendo Wii. Though Dirt 2 is coming to multiple platforms, the Wii version will contain unique features. The game has three different single-player modes. World Tour mode has players competing for first place in various races across four tours. Arcade includes exhibition races, a championship mode, and time trials. Codemasters promises at least 20 different challenges in the game's challenge mode, although we haven't been able to take any of them on just yet. World Tour mode is clearly the central feature. It's broken up into four divisions, with each containing various circuits and raids. Many tracks have multiple versions too, such as a reverse course or more open races featuring alternate paths. We got to try out over a dozen different tracks, with many of the courses still hidden away for the final build. You'll obviously need a sweet ride if you want to cross the finish line ahead of the pack, and Dirt 2 offers seven different vehicle classes. Players can rev up a BMW Z4, Hummer H3R, Mitsubishi Evo X, and many more. You'll only have one vehicle per class available at the outset, but earning gold medals will unlock more options. You'll definitely have some kind of choice, but there's no word yet on whether or not customization options, such as the libraries and conversion packs, will make it into the final Wii version. Players also have the option to go head-to-head -head with up to four racers in the multiplayer versus mode, or take on the challenge mode together. Versus mode lets players pick five different courses to take on in sequence, with the final standings determined by points earned for finishing in the top three spots each race. Unfortunately, the Wii iteration of Dirt 2 will not support any online functionality. Instead, you'll be restricted to split-screen action in the same room. What really sets the Wii version apart from its brethren is the various control options offered. There's the standard input via Wii Remote Nunchuck or the classic controller, but players can also use the Wii Remote like a steering wheel or grab hold of the Logitech Wii Wheel for those with a peripheral. Seemingly, the only option Dirt 2 doesn't support is the standard GameCube controller. The Wii has had a surprisingly weak showing in the racing genre thus far, but Codemasters will attempt to reach the winner's circle next month when Dirt 2 races onto store shelves.